now today we are going to learn about integrals chapter number 7 class 12 integrals integrals chapter number 7 So what do we mean by integral? It is antiderivatives. Anti derivatives. Means reverse process of differentiation is integral. Reverse process of differentiation is integral. So antiderivatives are it is also known as primitive. Primitive. So this is integral. Now integrals are of two types. Integrals are are of two types. So one is indefinite integral. Indefinite integral. And another is definite integral. Definite integral. So what is the difference between indefinite and definite integral? What is the difference between indefinite and definite integral? In def in the in indefinite integral, there is no limit of no limit of integration no limit of integration in case of definite integral there is a limit of integration there is a limit of integration integration so first we will learn about indefinite integral so actually what is indefinite integral Indefinite integral one go q. Okay. So indefinite integral there is no limit of integ integrals integration. But in definite definite integral there is a limit of integration. There is a limit of integration. So now first we will learn about indefinite integral. Indefinite integral. In definite integral, so in definite integral, now consider the function. Let f x be a function. Let f x be a function. Then the family of all its primitive, primitive or antiderivatives or antiderivatives is called is called indefinite integral. Indefinite integral and is denoted by denoted by integration symbol fx dx now indefinite integral suppose fx is a function fx say or a function means that is the family of all primitive you do the function for integration because the answer means antiderivative see when I see integration this is the symbol of integration so fx dx fx dx this is the integrated form indefinite integral this is indefinite integral indefinite integral means there is no limit of integration there is no limit of integration means it's like yes for money and pay limit lives and I am a limit lives and I means 
इसको इंटीग्रेशन को लिमिट छ देर इज नो नो लिमिट अफ इंटीग्रेशन देर इज नो लिमिट अफ इंटीग्रेशन ओके द सिंबल द सिंबल इंटीग्रेशन ऑफ एफ एक्स डी एक्स इज रीड एस रीड एस द इंडिफाइनेट इंट्रीगल रीड एस द इंडिफाइनेट इंट्रीगल इंडिफाइनेट इंटीग्रल ऑफ एफ एक्स ऑफ एफ एक्स विथ रेस्पेक्ट टू एक्स सिंबल दिस सिंबल इज रीड एज इंडिफाइनेट इंट्रिगल अफ एफ एक्स इसके इंडिफाइनेट इंट्रिगल भाई डिफ्रेन्सिट कर दी हाल व्हाट इज इंडिफाइनेट दिस इज इंडिफाइनेट दिस इज इंडिफाइनेट इंट्रिगल इंडिफाइनेट and this is suppose it has limit there is a and here is b so it is definite so this symbol indicates it as it is indefinite integral of fx with respect to x elle ji bancha this is indefinite integral of fx with respect to x manera bancha okay यू थे हम इंडिफाइनेट इंट्रिगल सो नाउ वेर दिस इज पाई एक्स इज प्रिमिटिव प्रिमिटिव पाई एक्स इज प्रिमिटिव ऑफ एफ एक्स ऑफ एफ एक्स एंड सी is arbitrary constant arbitrary constant called integration constant so this is phi x if phi x is the primitive phi x is the primitive okay let, let us take integration u u i mean let us take fx dx so it will be after integrating kasto huncha bhanda heri chai this is phi x plus c in case of indefinite integral we will put after integration c hami le c put garchau after integration so in this case this is primitive yo primitive huncha So this is integration constant. Integration constant. Okay. Now symbol of integral is like as. This symbol. This symbol indicates indefinite integral. Indefinite, definite integral and f x is integrand. F x is integrand. of indefinite integral f x is integrand suppose the function is f x dx here now this is integrand now what is dx dx is element this is used in dx is an element element 
एलिमेंट फॉर इंटीग्रेशन एंड डिफ्रेंसिएशन यो डीएससी इसमें आपका एलिमेंट हो जो सच इंटीग्रेशन में अपनी यूज़ करनी चाहिए डिफ्रेंसिएशन में अपनी यूज़ करनी चाहिए विदाउट डीएक्स वी कैन नॉट इंटीग्रेट और वी कैन नॉट डिफ्रेंसिएट द फंक्शन यो बायो एफएक्स इज इंटीग्रेट एंड डीएक्स इज एलिमेंट नाउ लेट अस टेक वन फॉर्मूला सपोज इंटीग्रेशन ऑफ एक्स टू द पावर एन डीएक्स इज एक्स टू द पावर एन प्लस वन डिवाइडेड बाय एन प्लस वन प्लस सी हियर नाउ दिस इज द इंटीग्रेंट इंटीग्रेंट नाउ इट इज प्रीमिटिव And last one, this is integration constant. This is integration. C is integration constant. Integration constant. This one, this is integrand. You integrand do. This is primitive. And in case of indefinite integral, there is a constant called integration constant. Okay. Now. What is integral? What is the difference between integral and integration? What is integration? I mean, listen to me. Integration and integral are only two things. But these are different. So, integration. What is integration? It is a process. it is a process to find the indefinite integral indefinite integral to finding to finding the to finding the indefinite integral indefinite integrals of fx with respect to x suppose this is indefinite integral process of finding the indefinite integrals of fx with respect to x means l i g इसको इंडिफाइनेट इंटीग्रल जो चाहिए निकालने प्रोसेस लाइज ही कि बन सा इंटीग्रेशन बन सा। फॉर एग्जांपल, वी नो दैट एक्स टू द पावर एन डीएक्स इज एक्स टू द पावर एन प्लस वन डिवाइडेड बाय एन प्लस वन प्लस सी। सो लेट्स टेक सम एग्जांपल, स्मॉल एग्जांपल। सो एग्जांपल इज इंटीग्रेट ऑफ एक्स ट� And this is an element. Now we have to integrate this. So this equals to now put this formula in this function. So it will be x to the power three plus one divided by three plus one plus here c. So it is primitive, and this is integration constant. After this, x to the power four by four plus c. Now this much is your process involved. So this process involved. So this is called integration. This part is called integration. Your process is called integration. Uh, this was for today, and from uh, from next class, I'll start inverse process of differentiation is integration. Okay. Now thank you.